Hey everybody! Welcome! So today we're going to be talking about our newest line, the Integra Solar. So um, for those of you who aren't familiar, Integra is a company that is known for their um, apron style carriers. I'm just going to try and make it a little brighter in here. It's a bit cloudy today. Can everybody see me okay? And I've turned on the captioning at least on Facebook, so it should be working, but if not, let me know. If you mute, it should show something up though that I'm saying, okay? Um, so today we are talking about the water carrier, the Integra Solar, and I'm really excited about this. I know that a lot of you are getting ready to, um, you know, to get into summer spirit and the summer mode, uh, and um, you want to carry your little ones, but you're worried about the heat, you're worried about um, uh, water, um, you're worried about uh, going to the theme park or going, um, you know, just kind of any of the fun things that we've all really been looking forward to lately, uh, um, you know, trying to do more of, and you want to know uh, if your um, if your carrier will work. And so, yes, your carrier probably will work, but I do have some new carriers that I think you're really gonna love. Uh, and um, they are they are wonderful. So today we're gonna do a demo of those. Sorry, I'm trying to adjust the height. We're gonna do a demo of the Integra Solar Carriers, and um, we're gonna look at the, the sizes, we're gonna look at the texture materials, and we're gonna look at the colors. I don't know if you can see that well behind me, but we've got a variety of colors here. Um, so I'm going to try to show you all of those, uh, or at least, at least as many as I grabbed out of the box. Okay. I'm really, really excited. If you have questions, leave me comments. Let me know what you want to see. We're going to do some comparisons of the different sizes and compared to other carriers that we have. Uh, but I'm very excited uh, to be, uh, to be sharing this with you. And I think this might be going in the Lenny Lamb group and it shouldn't be and I'm sorry about that that was an accident but you can still watch but it's not a Lenny Lamb product this one so um okay so let's so let's talk about what the Integra solar carrier looks like okay So here's an example of the size one. Uh, and so Integra is made in the UK. Uh, and they uh, they say that this size one uh, can be used uh, from baby to toddler if you desire it. So if you have a very small baby, uh, a size one is definitely the right choice for you. And we're going to look at the other sizes too. Uh, but it should have some, uh, you know, some flexibility from that sizing as well. The material is, um, is soft. Um, it's not, um, you know, I mean, it doesn't feel like, like, you know, like a blanket, right? But it, it, it feels kind of like a silky smoothness to it. Okay. I don't know um, how much you can see, but it's kind of silky smooth. Um, and it's, it's pleasant. It's not, um, it's not scratchy. It's not like irritating. Um, it's, it's pleasant. Uh, it's almost like, almost like a board short material, but like a more pleasant, uh, board short material, like a nicer quality one. The uh, straps are lightly padded. I believe this is a uh, polyester fill. Uh, all of the outside fabric is a UVA, UVB protected fabric. Hi, wave. <laughs> um, all of the outside fabric is UVA, UVB protected, 95 to 99% uh, rated uh, certificate protection. Uh, and then I think it's just a little bit of polyester fill in the arms. Okay, so that's what that looks like. Um, this is generally used as a cross. Hi, Jesse. Um, this is generally used as a uh, cross strap. So I'm going to show you what that looks like. And this is what we call an apron style carrier. And you can see that little flag there, right? These are made in the UK. This is what we call an apron style carrier. So sometimes we want to uh, wear in the water, but we kind of want something that's a little bit more familiar, but also very simple to use. And so the apron style, if you're not familiar with it, is, is basically kind of what it sounds like. So the, you'll see the buckle is set up like this. I love the Integra Solar. Yes, yay, Sarah. It's really nice. And I think it's like, I mean, it's like one of the only ones of its kind. Um, it's really cool. Uh, so an apron style carrier, you've got the buckles like this, um, which means you're going to put it on like that. And I'm going to put this pretty high 
So I'm going to use my small demo baby. If she's down here. Yeah, she's down here. I'm going to use my small demo baby. So I'm going to put her pretty high. Um, and so what we've done here is now we have a, now we have the whole panel that's kind of draped like an apron in front of you, right? That's an apron style, draped like an apron in front of you. Uh, and what we're going to do is we're going to put baby in and putting baby in and pulling this up is what makes the seat. So when you hear, um, you know, me say or other people say um, to get baby out into the panel and off the waistband, things like that, this ha is set up. So you've kind of already done that, which makes it a really nice carrier for something like a vacation or going out where uh, you can just say, hey, just put this on. OK, just just buckle it like an apron and pull it up over you. OK, really simple design um, that's, that's kind of easy to do. So there aren't too, too many um, out there with this with this design so it's it's a nice one to try okay uh so i'm not sure if i'm seeing comments on instagram or not it's not coming up well so if you are um let me know <laughs> okay um so i'm gonna go ahead and grab my demo baby and i'm gonna show you how how we put this on and how we adjust it so like I said, this is UVA, UVB protective fabric, okay, and it's also got a bit of adjustability. Now this baby is about, about like a four month baby, okay, um, and for this purpose for setting up, I'm kind of just going to adjust the uh, width after we do this, but you could potentially uh, set it up before if you want to, right? So I've got baby in the panel. So as you can see, it was kind of already made, right, because, uh, because of the apron. So I'm going to take this down and across. Okay, that's how we do the cross straps. That's the easiest way to do it. And we're going to clip. Okay, and then we take the other side. Same thing. Down and across. And clip. Okay. So that's sort of part one. Okay, so baby's in the carrier. Now, let's say I want to adjust this um, this panel, right? So I probably could have set it up beforehand, but let's say I put baby in and I realized I wanted it a little bit shorter, right? Because I want um, because I want the panel to to be knee to knee, and it's a little bit bigger than I want. You really just so webbing is tight no matter on any new carrier, so that's, that's why sometimes you see me like yanking on things because it's not something that I've really played with. Yeah. I'm just going to move that out of the way so you can see. So it's a very, very simple adjustment. You kind of put it where you want it and kind of tighten it till it's where you want. Now this baby, um, it's, it's okay the, kind of the way that it is right now. You kind of just want the panel knee to knee supporting the baby and not making them stretch their legs out. So we could do a little bit tighter. But, okay. um, and so you could adjust that again before they go in. Now, what is this? Okay, this is this is a hood. So this is totally up to you. If, you, if this doesn't bother you, you can kind of just let it hang free, right? Uh, if you want it kind of tucked up nicely, just sort of fold. Okay, the sunshade is also heat protective, right? Um, sun protective, right? Which is really nice. And this fabric is very light. It's very like silky smooth and light. Okay. I'm just kind of folding that. And see this buckle here? Okay. Now we've got our nicely folded protection for the heat, sunshade. A little bit of extra head support, baby goes to sleep. We can tighten it a little bit, get a little bit of extra head support, okay? See my baby's close enough to kiss? That's where we want them. That's why I had that waist so high, because this is a small baby. So uh, something to think about if you're not sure on with, um, if you're not sure you're getting baby in the right position with a carrier like this, with a soft structured style carrier, higher, like this baby is high. You saw how high I put the waistband on. Um, and this is, this is getting a good a good fit for this baby. Okay, so uh, let's say, um, yeah, I mean, so let's say your baby's bigger, right? The head can sort of extend, right? Because it's it's very simple. It's very moldable. There's nothing really to adjust. You just kind of fold how you want it and clip. And then, of course, you can always let that go down like that, okay? If you wanted to nurse in this carrier, 
you would just um oh and the the waist you see you can adjust it two different directions okay so that makes it nice and easy if you're kind of one-handed you can kind of yank on either side it's not that big a deal right to to get baby in if you wanted to nurse in this carrier you would simply loosen the waistband okay so i'm just kind of pull like that loosen the waistband shimmy baby down i might have to loosen these straps so i'll just open that up open that up and especially like if you're at the beach or something and you you're in a bathing suit and you might already feel a little bit exposed or a little bit uncomfortable postpartum as I think a lot of us do um this is an easy way that you can nurse baby and you don't have to, like nobody's really going to notice look I'm going to put baby in a position like we're going to do that so I did to loosen a lot for this because remember this baby's up high this is a small baby but basically you just loosen and move baby to the breast okay and then they're supported. Of course, you're always keeping an eye on baby in their airway. We don't let them hang out here. We don't let them sleep there. When they're done that side. So just on the other side, fix whatever you need, your bathing suit, whatever uh, in there, right? And then when you're all done, okay, lift that waistband back up, supporting baby. Yank whichever one you can find, right? <laughs> whichever side you can find, yank on it. Tighten it back up. Get that baby high enough. And retighten the arms. You can pull that way too. Okay, these are two directional arms too, which is so, so nice in a suction carrier. So nice. Okay, there you have it. And then baby's back. Okay, you adjust. Um, I still still think this a little bit tighter, but that's that's the idea. Okay, so this this is really nice. Um, to to just go right to just get up and go you can do anything you want you can care for other kids you can walk on the boardwalk uh you can walk around on the pool you don't have to worry about the chlorine splashing you you don't have to worry about the salt spray um this is gonna this is gonna handle that it's gonna take care of it okay um and and it's it's meant it's meant for that let's take a look at how small these pack down okay so this is the size one packed down for shipping. Okay. It's like, it's like the size of your beach, maybe a little bit bigger, but it's like the size of your beach novel and way, way lighter. Okay. Super light, super easy to toss this into your beach bag, into your, um, into your, into a big purse, anything like that. Okay. This is the size three in comparison. Okay. That's the largest size. There are three sizes. Definitely bigger, but still packs down really small and very light. Okay. Um, I can actually weigh this here for you. Which I haven't done yet. I'll weigh it for you now. You can see. So size one is is just under a pound. The size one. The size three is still. Yeah, still just under a pound, like just a little bit more. Um, so really, really light. Okay. Now let's take a look at sizing. Which size do we need? So for this size, the size one, they're recommending uh, at least seven and a half pounds. That's pretty, that's pretty typical. Um, this kind of style carrier, you want to make sure that baby is big enough. Okay. Um, I took the waistband off first. Don't, don't do that. <laughs> I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> This, don't don't ever take the waistband off first when you're, you're doing this. Um, you want to take off the arms uh, and then the waistband. So I still had baby pretty secure, and the apron actually almost gives it a little bit more security. But please don't do that with your baby. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna set this baby down for a second. I'm just gonna loosen that out, and I'm gonna show you the difference between the sizes. All right, so size two, we're recommending starting at 22 pounds and up. I'm going to show you it compared to this one and compared to some other carriers you might know of uh, that we have. And the size three starting at 33 pounds. And so if you've seen our, um, you know, the, the cover photo for the event or the, the uh, navy uh, dark blue, uh, that is uh, being modeled by, by a little one who is um, about 33 pounds, but a little bit taller for for his age. Okay. 
I'm going to go ahead and open up this one. So there's a couple of colors that are brand new this year that I don't have good pictures of. So I'm just going to show you the difference here and hopefully grab some of those good pictures today. Um, but we've got electric pink, mulberry, which is like a pinky purple, very cute, uh, and Niagara, which is a dark purple. Okay, so those are the three that I have. Okay. Um, for the pinky purples. Okay, that's a so, and this is what it looks like when you get it. So let's do our unboxing together for the size two. And um, you should see this being modeled um, very soon as well. Okay. So what it looks like comes with your uh, little manual booklet, registration form. Okay, so I'm gonna set that to the side. Whoop. You see how it's all nicely folded up? So we've got the uh, adjuster strap is tucked around it. Okay, so that's a great way to store it. Okay, I'm doing that. And we're just gonna unfold, okay? So we've got that there. Okay, this looks like it was kind of the top of the panel that was folded down. And then, actually, no, it must have been the bottom. <laughs> so, um, then we fold out. You see the arms. Okay. And then that waist strap just kind of fell out there. Um, but that's that's the idea. Okay, you can sort of pack it in nice and tight. Gather out, gather all that up. Gather it all up. And fold. And wrap. And that's a very poor wrapping job, so some of you will be much more <laughs> diligent than I would be, but I just, it's just, I don't care that much when I do it for my personal stuff. <laughs> okay, so let's take a look at the size two compared to the size one and also compared to some of our other carriers. So if you have some of those other ones, you can kind of get an idea of what that looks like. But again, they all have these adjuster straps to help with the panel too. And again, I love that these are made in the UK. I love that there aren't that many. I mean, I really don't know of any other company doing this, uh, doing the soft structure carrier uh, apron style, especially like this water carrier. It's really cool. Um, they um, you use in yeah. they make things with minimal environmental impact. That's really important to them at Integra, uh, which is really awesome. So you can see that difference there in the panel uh, width between the two and the one. Okay, and. If you look at the height, it's harder to see with the um, with the hoods. Let me see if I can kind of show you better. So if we kind of line up the tops, just kind of top of the shoulder there. Let's see if we can see the bottom a little bit better. It's I know it's hard to see, but it's 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 a, a couple inches uh, longer there too. So that's the two versus the one. Okay. Let's take a look at that compared to some other ones you might be familiar with, just to get an idea, and then we'll look at it compared to the three. So, and again, they're recommending the two starting at about 22 pounds and kind of going up as long as you're comfortable, uh, and the uh, three starting at 33 pounds. Right, so this is our Lenny Go baby standard size. So this sizing is comparable uh, in also in the baby standard on Bohemo as well. So if you've got, if you've tried either of those and your kid fits really well in that, that's how th that sizing compares to this. Okay, so I'm going to show you. And remember, the Go starts at about four months, and the size one uh, is is starting at you know at, at seven and a half pounds. Right, so um, that's kind of the difference there. Two. So definitely a shorter uh, panel waist. Let me see if I can match it up panel for panel as opposed to just the waistband so you can kind of see. So the maximum is actually really not that, really not that different for the maximum. You can kind of see that, which this is designed to go to about two T pants, the standard size. Okay, so the maximum is very similar. Um, you know, not exact, but, but similar, okay? Um, 
And let's take a look at the length, which is a little bit, because it's an apron, right? So it's kind of making that seat. So we'll, we'll kind of put it around there-ish. Uh, and that's, I think I've got the hood folded up a bit. So folding it up there. I know it's hard to see. I'll try to get some good, uh, try to get some good measurements for you. All right. Let's say about, about there to there. Okay, so it actually might be a little bit bigger even than this one in the panel. But of course, remember, this is an apron style. So I would say they're pretty comparable. So if your little one is fitting well in this, um, a size one, you know, might might be fine. Okay, that might be that might be good. If you're getting close to that 20 pound mark already, um, I would go to the size two, right? Because that's going to be a little bit bigger than this one. Let's compare the size two to the baby standard. Let me go. Just to get an idea. So again, this is a really great choice. Even if you're not wearing your little one all the time, we visited with um, with my parents where um, and we're on the we were on the boardwalk and. Oh my goodness, like our son is a great walker. He's got a lot of, you know, he's got a lot of great dexterity um, and, and he's really, really fast, but he was tired on the boardwalk. And I love, love, love the linen carrier that I brought. I love it. It's amazing. It feels so comfortable and it's wonderful. But something like this would definitely have been nice because it's so light to carry. And when your arms are full or the stroller is full uh, in <laughs> and you're walking down the, the, the thing and the kid doesn't want to walk and they don't want to be in the stroller and they don't want be this or you don't want to lug the stroller um i mean this this is really nice to have because you could stuff it almost in any bag uh that you're already carrying with you and it's very light it's not going to add a lot of that to it so if your little one halfway to getting to fresh halfway to thrasher's fries says i can't make it the next four blocks um you've got something already in your bag <laughs> okay so this is um i'm just going to show you how much wider that panel is so this is okay so this is the end of the Lenny Go standard, and this is the end of the Integra, okay? So again, it is an apron style, but it's definitely bigger than this one. So I'm going to show you the size 2 compared to the toddler Lenny Go. And remember, we usually recommend the toddler Lenny Go for when your little one is in 2T pants uh, and then up, right? So that's what we've got there. And let me know if you have questions. It's hard to... Oh, look, I might have comments already. I'm not seeing. Uh, Sarah, I actually have that color in a size 2 for my toddler. Oh, it's so beautiful. Wonderful. Uh, BJ, I've got a 50-inch waist. My buckle here is a bit prohibitive as they don't always fit or feel comfortable. What is the length around the waist? That's a really good question. I, I will measure it after this, and I'll comment back to you, BJ. Thank you so much. Um, Sarah, it's more flattering in my opinion, too, especially if you're wearing a bathing suit. Yeah, <laughs> it is. It is. Yeah. Okay. Um. So, sorry guys sometimes it doesn't always tell me that comments have come in so but I am I am looking for them okay let me see so this is compared to the Lenny Go toddler so it is oh let's, let's make sure I'm lined it up so the Lenny Go toddler if you can see is about one or two inches maybe wider there Okay, in the panel. So the Lenny Go Toddler is bigger width-wise than the size 2. When we look at the height of the panel, and I'm just kind of going top of shoulder, right? Uh, and remembering that it's an apron, okay? Remembering it is going to go on a little bit different, but just kind of showing you um, it's got about the same height. Maybe the entire is a little bit taller um, for the size 2. So that's something to, to keep in mind, too. Okay. Um, so those are those are some comparisons. Is, is that helpful? Does this help? Okay, I'm going to show you compared to the size three now, the two to the three. So this is the largest one we have. And again, I think even if you've got a great walker, um, I think you... <sighs> When you're doing something like that, like you just, sometimes you just need to wrinkle them. They get tired in, in the heat and the sun and mommy, you know, oh, the waves push me over and I, mommy, I'm sad and I don't want to move. And 
you know, and then everybody's tired. It's just nice to have something to just, okay, come here. Um, so I think everybody, <laughs> everybody in the summer needs this. And this is safe to use on dry land. So if you're familiar with some other mesh carriers, a lot of mesh carriers on the market aren't comfortable dry. Um, they slip, they move around, um, they don't have support. Um, that is not the case here. I mean, this is definitely a very light carrier, so it's not going to have the same support uh, as, as you know, a, a sturdier one, right? I mean, I love my supportive carriers from, you know, my son's over 30 pounds and I, I love that that support right um but uh um, it's 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 nice sometimes to just just have something. Sometimes you just need something, uh, and and this is so easy to pack up and and get that to you. Okay, so this is the navy, um, and you can see um, see that difference in size there from the two to three, and kind of from top of panel to top of panel. Um, probably a similar. A similar distance okay from top of panel to top of panel and I know the sizes don't look that different but remember that when your uh, little one is growing they grow so much faster in that first period of life in that first year and then the growth they certainly grow several inches you know every year but it's it's slower it's much slower it's not that rapid growth so if your little one is still very small you might be like there's not that big a difference but it, it is it is a difference because of that the ages of the children is going to um, okay, so let's take a look at the difference in color between a couple of these, um, because I know some of the colors aren't showing up that well um, online. So this is navy compared to ocean, or ocean blue. I'm not sure which one it is. Let me see if you again. There you go. Okay. okay, so the ocean compared to ocean blue. So I don't know if you can see that difference. The navy is definitely darker. Um, I would say that the ocean is more of like a, a royal blue. Uh, so if that's something that you like, I'd say this is more of a medium royal blue. They're both very beautiful solid blues, uh, but that's that's kind of the difference that I see there. Okay, and then let's take a look at a couple other I want to say, I want to say this one is lucite gray. I can't remember if that's the term they used, um, but this this is the gray. I'll grab the olive too. Um, so this is the gray. This is the new color vanilla. Okay, so I don't have a good picture of that yet. I have to get it. Um, they didn't have the picture for me. But this is a new color, I believe. Uh, and then this is Meadowlark. It is a bright yellow. So if you are like me and you're always like, where, where is the little one? Where's the little one? Um, that's <laughs> that's something good if your little one is a runner. Um, you know, this is nice, right? That's mine. That's my thing, right? Or if you're, I guess really because it's the carrier, if, you're, if your uh, partner is a runner, right? <laughs> Where'd you go? I don't know. You went you went in front of me to the thrashers? Okay, that's fine. I'll find you later. So that's that's what this is for. Or if an older sibling is carrying a younger sibling, right? Um, you know, maybe this is something that's easy to spot. Um, or if you just like yellow. I mean that's a lovely color. It's just it's bright. So that's what I'm trying to say to you. Vanilla, very nice gray. And let's compare that to the olive. Olive. Okay, so that's kind of what they all look like together. And yeah, that's all of the name of this color. Let's see if I can grab that for you. Oh, that other one is gr glacier gray. Excuse me, glacier gray was that one. Um, oh, I might be wrong. That purple might be ultraviolet. Sorry, guys. I'm maybe I don't have Niagara right now. Sorry guys, I don't I don't think I was showing you Niagara. I'm gonna take a look at it. I'm gonna take a look and figure it out. <laughs> figure out the differences there. Sorry about that. Um okay, so this is maybe this one's Niagara. Okay. To be determined. I wish that they had something on here that told me what they're calling me. So this is the first time I've seen them. This might actually be Niagara. I might be wrong. I am going to confirm. Um, you'll see on the website that Niagara doesn't have a picture right now. That's um, so um, I will confirm. <laughs> I get that to you. I know that other one is vanilla. I'm pretty sure. Well, let's compare this to the olive. Okay. 
Um, let me show what goes as to the pink. Greens are like hard to see. This is like a, a light, light green. Okay. Okay, I hope that helps. Besides the fact that I've confused a lot of the colors. <laughs> but, um, the ocean blue versus the navy, definitely I know. I um, mean, you kind of saw the range of the pinks. Uh, and hopefully, I, I'm going to think, I think I'm going to get some comparison colors of some of those close colors uh, and post those up. Let me know if that would be helpful if I added those to the product listings. Just kind of like, these are the three pinks next to each other, or these are the two blues next to each other. Let me know if that would be helpful. Um, yeah, so again, all of these have adjustable adjustable uh, width with this, a very simple design. If you don't need it, you can leave it, right? Like, it's not it's not a crisis it's meant to be a very simple easy to use um easy to use carrier easy to pop in and out um nice and light safe for the pool safe for the beach sea spray now of course we are never going to do things like swim uh with baby and carrier right or um dive right we're, we're not we're not doing stuff like that it's not a life preserver it's not you know it's not gonna help keep you float it's not gonna do any of those things it's really meant for like i'm waiting in the pool maybe i'm watching the other kids maybe i am um you know maybe i just want to explore the water right and i don't want to just sit on the sit on the beach or just sit on the side of the pool i want to walk in and enjoy and, and get a little bit wet uh but remember of course it's not you know it's we're not gonna go swimming right it's not it's not going to be safe for baby. Um, it dries really quick. It's a nice quick dry fabric. Um, it's, I mean, it's just very light. I don't know, like even this one, which is designed to hold um, more weight, might be rated up to 50 pounds. I'm going to have to check. I'm going to have to check. Um, let's see if it says on here the rating. Uh, to 24 kilograms might be about 50 pounds. Um, I'll, I'll convert that and I'll, I'll make sure that that's added if it's not there. But even that, which needs a little bit more fabric to do that, I'm um, still very light, still very breathable and um, will dry quickly. Um, yeah, just really, really great. So let me know if you have other questions. Um, I will definitely get that measurement for you. I can do that right after this uh, live. Uh, 55 ish. Thank you, BJ. So yes, up to 55, rated up to 55 or so pounds. Thank you. Um, so I will get that. I will get that, uh, with measurement. I know that's really helpful. If there are other measurements specifically that you'd like, um, I'll try to get some panel height and width too, so you can compare. Um, yeah, let me know. And thank you so much, everybody. So enjoy. I think you're really, really going to love these and we've got some more. So I'll do my, woo. <laughs> This is my special surprise. See that now I can be in the Lenny group, right? Because woo, uh, that's my special surprise that's coming very, very soon. Okay. Um, so thank you so much, everybody, and have a great day.